and welcome back to the UGA, the Universal Gaming Association. My name is Benjamin aka Silent and today we will play our week 8 match against the team Andy Should Pain. So, as always uh, I will first um, talk a little bit about what I expect in this game and what I expect my opponent brings in this game and later I will show you my team before we start with the match. So, yeah, let's see the team of my opponent. First thing I see is this Thunderous, and as he has, I mean, he has a Grookey, a Grookey no Throcky, but um, the only real way to deal with my Blastoise is his Thunderous. Thunderous is a special attacker, I mean, he has a good uh, physical attack, but uh, yeah, he's, his um, better stats are in special. That means I will run my Blasters with an Assault Vest, but I will explain this later. Um, but I think you will bring Thunderous for sure. Uh, Thunderous is also good for my um, for my Surfetch, so he can cover two of my Pokemon I can probably bring him. Um, next Pokemon I expect is uh, Colossal and Dragapult. I mean, I have Redirection by Dragapult, uh, but his Dragapult uses Surf, that means I can't redirect his Surf to proc his uh, weakness policy. And uh, yeah, I mean, Colossal is bad against um, Blastoise and Hippodon, but I think he will probably bring him neither. So, uh, either. so yeah, I expect these two to come. Next Pokemon I expect is Sukun. Sukun is a great supporter with Snarl. I have to um, be careful with, with Snarl Suicune this week. Uh, Suicune can also set up the Tailwind, which is also pretty scary. I mean, at least my Reggie Ice can't be Snarled uh, with this Clear Valley effect, so should be good there. Um, and for the last Pokemon I expect this week, it's Scrafty. Scrafty, Fake Out, Intimidate, uh, pretty scary. Um, yeah, and it's also good against my Mesprit because, yeah, Dark type is good against it. Um, for the last Pokemon, I don't know what he brings. Maybe he goes with Double Intimidate with my Wild. My Wild is pretty good, and I um, don't have good Fire type Pokemon. I just hit it on to deal um, with my Wild. Uh, Slowpuff is an option if he runs Grookey as well. Um, maybe if he's really scared of Blastoise, he brings Thunderous and Grookey, uh, Thwacky. Rhinoclus is an option if he wants to go slow, but um, his team isn't as Trick Room... I mean, I see not that much Trick Room monsters here. Colossa can go Trick Room if he want, just wants to proc his weakness policy with Bulldogs, but I don't know, his team is not... I think Rhinoclus is more for... I don't have... I have... Uh, yeah, I don't think you will bring it really, really close. But Bullflight. Bullflight is an option. Um, I mean, he has Zap Zipper. I have no Grass types in my team. But Bullflight is pretty strong and I have to watch out for him. So, without further ado, I will show you the six Pokemon I've chosen to bring this week. Um, first of all, my Blastoise, as I said before, with an Assault Vest just to. Um, Play well against Thunderous. Uh, for the EVs, spreads max attack, max HP, and 107 um, speed, which will come in handy to outspeed his Dragapult and everything else in his team. But uh, besides, may maybe he runs Choice Scarfed on someone, but without Choice Scarfed, my Blastoise and Tailwind should outspeed his whole team. Uh, ability, normal ability, not Rangish, I will not set up Rain this week. Uh, for the text, Hydro Cannon, I think I will max um, Blastoise always this week. So why not run Hy Hydro Cannon? Um, Ice Beam is there to deal with uh, his Thwaki, to deal with his uh, Thunderous, and to deal with his Dragapult if he has to. I also run the Darkpult just for the Reuniclus and to lower my opponent's special defense. It's special defense, right? Yeah. Uh, to lower my opponent's special defense, which, which kind of handy. I have many special attackers this week. 
And uh, for the last move, I have Fake Out because Fake Out is always good, and I can't run, run Protectors in Assault West. Um, next Pokemon, Clefable with an anti Steel Berry, just in case he goes my wild for my Clefable. Um, the moves are the EVs are pretty standard, max HP, not max HP, but nearly. Um, unaware ability that means if he uh, proxies weakness policy on his call so he will not do more damage than he would normally do without the weakness policy proc. And for the moves, Moonblast to do some damage on Dragapult, um, Helping Hand. Uh, follow me and protect. Nothing really special about this clef I've run this set uh, several times this season. I really like it. Um, for the next Pokemon, I bring on Reggie Ice this week with a Citrus Berry. I've run uh, Citrus Berry, Reggie Ice, I think week one or week two. Um, it's speedy. Normally, I run a really slow Reggie Ice, slow bulky Reggie Ice because. Yeah, why not? Um, Reggie is slow, but this week I will run uh, really fast. Um, I'm not sure how fast he is. 210. It's the same speed like Blastoise. It's even faster than Blastoise. That means uh, my Reggie Ice will outspeed uh, Dragapult in Tailwind. Yeah. Um. Okay. Ability, clear body, of course he can't snow me. Um, and for the moves I have Ice Beam, I have Charge Beam, which means I have a 70% uh, that my special attacks raises one stage. Uh, ancient Power, Ancient Power was there for purpose. Um, I just can't see it. Where I want, I want to use, ah yeah, against Colossal. Colossal is um, Rock. Rock fire and is weak against rock type moves. So yeah, my I have ancient power just for Colossal. I don't think I would click it otherwise. Um yeah. And protect on last slot. So yeah, speedy Reggie Ice this week. Um for next Pokemon I have my Hippodome with uh, rests to leftovers to um, get some health back every turn. Max HP, max um, attack, but not uh, minimum speed. As I said before, this week I will run um, Tailwind. I run him also with the uh, Sandstorm ability to set my Sandstorm up. That means I can um, stack some chip damage on my opponent with the uh, Hydro Gigamax Hydro Cannon from Blastoise. Um, for the moves, Stomping Chantron and Rock Slide, that's really all I need this week. I think I can uh, hit pretty much everything. Rock Slide on Thunderous, Earth Attack on Earth, 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 Rock, Earth. Yeah, I, I think I can hit everything at least neutral with Rock and with, um, with Ground. And then if he wants to run um, Trick Room, I can go slow with my uh, Purse. I can lower my um, my speed stat with that. Um, I also have protect because protect is always good. And yeah, it's this set. And for the not the last Pokemon, I have my Dracozolt this little week with Life Orb. I've run a special Dracozolt again. Um, he has the uh, Sand Rush ability to double his speed stat. Descent. He has also um, 207 speed to outspeed Dragapult in Sand. Um, but I will not hit him with a Dragon Claw, I will hit him with a Draco Meteor. Because my opponent has two Intimidate Pokémon, uh, and I really don't want to play around Intimidate this week. That's just too stressful. Um, plan is my opponent is not aware of special Drag Assault. Uh, intimidates me with Mewile or with um, whoever he wants to play. Uh, the other Pokemon is what was the other Pokemon? Ah, Scrafty. And then he eats a Draco Meteor. I have to be careful if he brings Mewile because Mewile is a fairy type Pokemon and I can't fire uh, Draco Meteors into my opponent if he has a fairy Pokemon in the back because he can't just switch in. 
uh, for the other move, uh, this charge, this charge is pretty good to paralyze my opponents. Uh, my Hippodome, which normally should be on the field when Dragosaurus is on the field as well. Um, yeah, um, it's immune to electric type moves, sorry. And for the last move, uh, Earth Power to hit the Coal Cell pretty hard with four times uh, effective damage. Okay, and let's see our last Pokemon this week. It's Mandibus. So Mandibus was Joy Scuffed this week. I cannot beat the Dragapult. As you see, uh, my whole team is uh, made to outspeed his Pokemon this week. I really hope he does not go Trick Room, because if he goes Trick Room, uh, my only option here is uh, to go Cursed uh, Hippodon. I mean, it's an option. Hippodon is pretty good. Um, I am immune to... Um, I have the Overcoat ability, which makes me immune to the chip damage from my own Sand, which is pretty good. Um, max HP, max speed. As I said before, I really want to outspeed things here. Uh, it's even faster than everything. I, I think um, even with Scuffed, there's some Pokemon that can't outspeed my Mandibus here. And for the attacks, I have U-Turn. In the place I want to repositioning my Mandibus. I could, for example, if I face uh, Thunder Rose, if I go Reggie as a Mandibus and I face the Thunder Rose and whatever, I can just U-Turn out. And bring in my hippodon. Um, what's the English name for this name? Um, foul play, foul play. Yeah, with foul play, I should be able to outco the drag bolt. Should be good. As you have seen, I have um, four, three, three, four. I have four special attackers this week. That means I run fake tears. And for the last slot, uh, tailwind because tailwind, yeah, it's pretty good. Um, yeah, that's my team. I'm not sure if I can win this week because the team of Unleashed Pain is pretty, pretty strong. I will try my best. Um, the winner today will um, qualify for the playoffs, the loser will not. So, it's a really important game this week. Um, wish me luck. Good luck, have fun. And yeah, let's start the game. Okay, let's start our last regular season match of the UGA. Numa is um, choosing the rules. And we can already start. So, let's go. Maybe my last match. Uh, the player who wins this game will proceed to the playoffs. And whoever loses is out. So, good luck, have fun. Um, yeah, let's see. Um, I think I could start with Reggie Ice. Reggie Ice is pretty good here. Besides, my while, I mean, I could also go for Dragosault. Or even Tailwind. I think I can go for Drake Assault. No. Um, let's try this. Mandy Boss and Last Door. Reggie Ice. And later in the back, Drake Assault and Hippodon. And I will bring Blasters in the next game. He will not expect a fast Reggie Ice in the first game. I think. I hope. Or Choice Scaff Money Boss. I think he has no Scrafty in my while. So I mean that's the worst start um, Reggie Ice could get. Intimidate, okay. Just one intimidate? Okay. So, um, let's see. I could go for... 
for this who's more a threat I've really chosen the uh, worst start I can get. Um, I think I could try to one shot this crafty and do max ice into him. My Reggie ice should be faster than both. Maxing as well. Who's he maxing? My well. Oh, it's crafty. Okay. So let's see if the cho if the um fits enough what I'm doing here. Okay, he's AV, because if not, it's impossible that he can lift this. Some other things are getting more complicated. Money boss. Okay. So I think that's okay, kind of. Um, I could go now for this into my while. Later, take care of Crafty. I think a max uh, lightning should take care of it. And he will not kill me with a plus one max punch, I think. Some electric attacks are stronger. Later can bring in my Drake Assault. Okay, this will go into Reggie Eyes. Yeah, Reggie Eyes tanks this. Citrus Berry gives me a little bit of health back, which is important. I don't know if he already knew that I'm choice scarfed with Mandy Boss. Thunderous, okay. So I can go into Thunderous. I mean, do I really need my... I think I could go into another... something. Could try to take out... No, let's take out the Thunderous here. With max ice. Okay, I mean, um, I've clear body, that means you will not slow me down. It's live orb. I still have the sand mode on the back. Who's he going for? Reggie eyes. Okay, that means I can now bring in my um, my Dracozolt and switch in Hippodon. Yeah, I hope this little Pokemon is uh, Dragapult.
Okay, he's getting stronger, so now I really have to take care of him. Suicune is his last Pokemon, fantastic. So now I can uh, switch in my... I can switch in my Hippodome. And go for Discharge. You will not expect a dis Discharge here. is dead and Suikun is... Suikun will not 1v3 me. So this game should be over. A Tailwind, now you're fast. At least I can uh, see if I'm faster than Suikun with my Draco Salt. Okay, um, I think I can just protect here and go for Discharge. Or, oh, I mean, if he goes for an Ice Beam, maybe he's able to take me out. I will just double into. <sighs> okay, cool. So first game goes for me, which is pretty good. Um, let's see what he brings for the next game. Yeah, take his sleep card. Same rules. I mean, I really have expected a uh, colossal on his end, so. Um, I mean, I could go for Blastoise. Blastoise and Mandibus. Um, then with Reggie Eyes and Hippodon in the back. Thunderous and Scrafty, so I'm in a bad spot again, to be honest. Um, I think I have to go for Max Ice into Thunderous. And I could go for Oh, that's complicated. Um, we go for Tailwind here. Okay, I'm faster or I'm the only one maxing? He is life off. It means uh, he will not survive the hit from me. Okay, he's not maxing. Okay, fake out. Okay. I mean, it's it's still kind of okay. At least that I get rid of Thunderous, who's the only real threat to my Blastoise. And I think I can still set up the Tailwind.
Or maybe I could go into uh, fake tears and just crafty. Small threats. I think I can take Dragapult out later. Let me do this and go for Tailwind. Tailwind. Maybe Dragapult is targeting my Blastoise here, who knows. Getting off my max cannonade is important. Okay, we are seeing max scrafty again. Probably. Yeah, max scrafty again. If I lose this game, I should really bring my um my Cliff Fable. Jack on Meteor, okay. Okay, Dragapult is not a threat anymore, because he is low on special attack. Or maybe he is boosting out his attack step and can attack physically. At least now I've got the chip damage on my side. I think I could go for a max attack and for a... Let's double into... Or maybe he is attacking my, my hippo down here. Now oh, let's double into Scrafty. You're burning me. Okay, that should not kill my Pokemon. No. So now I've got you at least minus one as well. So now um, he's probably going to close combat something here. Light screen, okay, that's really annoying. Kill my Blastoise. Yeah, thank you very much. Blastoise out of the way. <sighs> ok, 
Okay, Dragapult is um, Dragapult is Dragometeor. Um, he is Dragometeor Light Spring Willowis and something else. Probably protect or ally switch. Okay, now if his last Pokemon is Sukun, I should be good. If his last Pokemon is my Wild, I could get in trouble. Moodbray. Okay, Moodbray is fine. I'm fine with Moodbray. So, I can go for an Ice Beam into his Moodbray. And for Stomping Counter and into Dragapult to take him out. Dragapult should not be able to do much damage on me. Okay. It's getting a defense boost. But I will attack you with Ice Beam. It's not enough to take Modbray out. Okay. Oh, he's going for a body press here. Oh, Iron Head. Okay, Iron Head's fine. Body press would have taken me out. Uh, now I think the um, yeah, the game is over. Now um, the Mega Cannon should take them both out. Yeah. Oh, no damage on mod right? Yeah, there is. Okay. Yeah, this game is over. Okay, let's go and this and. I mean, to be fair, um, Pnuma doesn't want it to win this game because um, I think he hasn't prepped much at all. Because he really don't want it to reach playoffs, I don't know why. But I'm glad I have won 2-0. Um, thanks for playing, Pluma. I hope you are back in uh, Season 4 of the UGA. And we are able to play again. And everyone, uh, thanks for watching and we see us on the playoff. Bye!